Hello, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Rosie and I'm an archaeological scientist based at the University of Cambridge. I am currently sat at the Faculty of Classics because I'm about to go into the Classics Library. I need two books and then I'm going to work on an article. It is the first week of term now in Cambridge and it's a lovely atmospheric, by that I mean grey, autumn day. And so I thought it would be a perfect day for a little day in the life. So yeah, come to work with me. I'll show you around autumnal Cambridge the classics and archaeology faculties and hopefully you enjoy <laughs> and hopefully I'm productive as well because I have to be Take my hand and hold it tight. This is my outfit of the day Can you actually see it? Here we are now and I'm just off to the central library to pick up a book for my boss. So busy! Of course you can really tell the students are back and because it's only first week they're all in the libraries like keen. I mean you can also tell it's freshers week because everybody in the library was coughing. Nice. There we are. Okay now here I thought we'd be busier than it is. It's not busy at all. Like we'll be inside. It's definitely given Halloween vibes here. For sure. I mean, I have to go to the sixth floor, so that's even more Halloween vibes, you'll see. Yeah. Floor five. Let's go. We're here. I didn't find it, I asked the librarian. I was in the complete wrong place. And now I'm starving, so it's lunchtime. To update you, it is now 6pm. I wish I wasn't still in the office. I'm actually in a different office because I needed a quiet space. I have Spanish now and normally I would go home for Spanish but I'm doing it in the office today. I did the last hour of kind of prep work because I haven't had a lesson in a while because I've been on holiday and then on a work trip which actually was to Malaga so I did speak Spanish in Malaga but now I've got an actual lesson till 7.20, it's a double lesson, it's an hour and 20 minutes. Oh, I'm hungry. Good we morning, campers. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Just about to have breakfast and then head straight to the office. Um, I have a bagel. What kind of bagel? It is onion and chive. 
people are going to really love when I speak to them today. And yeah. What a stunning day. I think I dressed for autumn. Well, hopefully. Okay, it's time for meeting number one. This is the Archaeological Science Lab meeting. So we discuss things that happen in the lab, people's new papers, goings on, all the fun stuff. Hello. I have come to a new library today and there's nobody in here, hence I'm talking, obviously. I wouldn't be speaking if there was people in here. This is the upstairs of the Archaeology and Anthropology Library, the Haddon Library. It's been closed all summer and now it's reopened. It's different than what I remember. I remember it having more of these book things with like desks at the end of each one. Maybe I'm remembering incorrectly, I don't know. I'm at least going to work here till lunchtime, which is not long now. It is 5 to 12, so I'll do another hour in here, I think, and then find somewhere else, or maybe come back, I don't know. We'll see. Um, there appears to still be a bit of work going on, so maybe... Maybe I won't be staying here. Okay, it is lunchtime now and I'm gonna go and have the pack lunch that I made myself. I actually pre-cooked. I made tofu and couscous and roast vegetables and I'm very excited, although I really could do some more seasonings because I forgot that when I bring my lunch in, I can't just add seasonings at the table. I should have cooked them in it. And I didn't, I did a bit, but not enough. Not enough. It's finally home time. I'm actually going to the gym. Hi, I'm home. Please excuse the post-gym hair. I literally just did half an hour of incline walking and then gave up, I'm not gonna lie. Because I was hungry and tired and I couldn't be bothered. And now I'm making my tea. We have so many tomatoes at the moment, as in from the garden, because they took ages to turn red and now they're all red so now we have hundreds of tomatoes so i'm trying to get through them and i'm frying them up with garlic spring onion some some weird green leaves i i asked for spinach with my sainsbury's order and then i didn't realize that they'd made a swap so i commandeered these vegetables i don't really know what they are i'm hoping it's gonna work this is the situation right now. I need to finish cooking. Oh, yeah, that's my sweeties. I need to finish cutting that up. I'm not doing anything exciting this Friday. I rarely do. I will probably, to be honest, just watch TV. Although I also need to edit and I need to write a paper, as in a paper that is not to do with my day job. So I'll write it on the weekends, evenings, holidays, you name it. And my deadline is the end of October, so I can do it and i am presenting it at an international workshop that i was invited to can i actually can't believe it can you believe it i can't believe it um i was invited and therefore they're paying for all of my travel i don't know quite how we got here but here we are so i've got to finish that i guess a girl boss too close to the sun and now i have to actually do the work but also it's friday night so i might just not <laughs> the water's ready rigatoni i bought this really fancy rigatoni because i was feeling sorry for myself 
uh, the other day, I was very tired, and rigatoni is my favourite, and this, ow, paper cut. I never know how much pasta is the right amount of pasta. I just know that too little pasta is the wrong amount of pasta. Okay, pasta's ready. This is a lot of pasta and I'm gonna enjoy every second of it. We have come a long way from the vlogs where I used to make pasta and baked beans in my first year kitchen at St. Peter's. Those were the days. It's 9.30 p.m. and to finish off my wild Friday night, I'm gonna read my book and then go to bed by 10. I'm really excited about that. This is a really exciting prospect. Next weekend, next weekend maybe I'll have a big one.